We're back with an I-Team exclusive, an investigation now underway into claims by black Rockland County High School basketball players that they were targeted with racial slurs at a game in Scarsdale on Saturday. Investigative reporter Sarah Wallace uh -oh. is live in Spring Valley and hearing from both sides. Sarah. What the fuck? Well, we are hearing from both sides, Adam. And what I can tell you for sure is that the game was stopped in the fourth quarter by the girls' coach who reported that racial slurs had been directed at his players from the stands. An investigation was immediately launched. What emotions are you feeling now? Sad, disappointed, angry. Erland LaFontant and several players from the Lady Titans, a joint team of Spring Valley and Ramapo High School, still reeling from the taunts they say they received on Saturday during a basketball game at Scarsdale High School. They were like, you little N-words cannot play basketball on the sideline. That's, That's what you heard. Clear as day. Clear. They called us the N-word, um, and then they called us um, monkeys on top of that, and then they were barking. Bark it, bark it. Yeah, like we were some. Who believes that? It's some evidence. Yo, I've got, at least it wasn't monkey noises, you know. Right. <laughs> wow. I believe it. Now, here's the thing. I believe it, but I believe that it was probably one asshole in the crowd who probably said it. And they're presenting it as if it's like a bunch of like everybody was just like nigger, nigger. Like I mean, I could see one asshole in the crowd saying something like that. I, I'll give them the benefit of the doubt, right? But sisters are so like they're so disrespectful. They always talk about people's race. And the first time you say so, it's kind of like um, the first time you say something to a son, man, is they they act like they're not who they are. Sons are literally somebody got a lot of um, Marcy, you you eating or something, man? I'm sorry, I'm Marcy putting the gun together. Vet. Marcy, a vet, he do every <laughs> show, man. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Ghost Rider said what I was going to say. I, I probably wasn't even a glider that was talking so. Well, I'm just yeah. taking a quick look at it. Scarsdale appears to be 1.6%. Yeah, I can believe that. That's why I said it. I can believe that. It's, it's, it looks like a, Could be a it's all white town. I can believe somebody in the crowd may have said something. Like, what? And they probably was playing the game. They heard something. What? And then it was like, oh, we need investigation. And it was probably nothing. It was probably representative of a, of just that one person. And every probably people who probably were a section away couldn't hear it. Or person, it's probably people who were right there didn't hear it. But they heard it, and they made a big deal about it. Yo, like, I know a lot about Scarsdale because I'm from New York, right? And, like, I definitely see maybe – some asshole in the crowd saying that, but I mean, like, she's acting like like people are cheering, like people are holding signs with the N word, like the like the mascot comes out and like calls it an N word. They were burning right. across. They were burning across. Yeah, they that's what they want to act like. Exactly. They want to act like they fucking burnt the burnt the basketball hoop and shit. Like, what the fuck, man? Some type of animals. Normally, games are locally live streamed, but the video from Scarsdale was taken down, and so far, no cell phone video has surfaced. It wasn't only barking; they were screaming in our faces too when we would get the ball, and that's just not how basketball is played. Like you don't scream in people's faces. Yes, they do. That's how the road. I listen. I played <laughs> in southeastern PA, man, and and in my in my high school years, man. And listen, man. <laughs> You go into them gyms and on the road in Philly, it's intimidating, man. It's scary. Going to a fucking gym in Philly on, on the road, it's scary, Jack. Or in the county. Nah. It's, it's like an NBA. Antagonize them. So you felt that. 
Yeah. They were provoking you. Yeah. The girls coach told me I had to pull my girls off the court and we took a forfeiture because I would not subject my athletes to that unacceptable behavior any longer. It was disrespectful and clearly racial. There is this video of the girls afterward questioning Scarsdale's athletic director. I would ask, I'm asking your coach to put this exactly in writing so I can address every item as it happens. I'm trying to do it in a methodical way so that it gets the attention it needs. Now, this glider thinks that he addressed this properly. There's a 1,000% chance that them sisters are dissatisfied with how he handled it. Press one. <laughs> Look at him, man, being a glider. Afterward, questioning Scarsdale's athletic director. I would ask, I'm asking your coach to put this exactly in writing so I can address every item as it happens. I'm trying to do it in a methodical way so that it gets the attention it needs. You should never, you should never have to endure that, ever. I know I may not look like it, but I am a man of color. <laughs> wow. What oh the fuck, bro? Jesus. Oh, Jesus. What is this country, man? Like, oh, just, man. we have grown adults having these fucking weird ass conversations. It's like a fever dream sometimes. <laughs> I think Hot Black's going to get him a one way ticket to Iceland. Shit. He's like, fuck it, I'm done. Take me back. <laughs> I was not expecting that one. <laughs> right. Uh, that, that was that, that and they're cool. like, person of color? I don't understand this term. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> we can't make this up. And clearly racial. There is this video of the girls afterward questioning Scarsdale's athletic director. I would ask, I'm asking your coach to put this exactly in writing so I can address every item as it happens. I'm trying to do it in a methodical way so that it gets the attention it needs. You should never, you should never have to endure that, ever. I know I may not look like it, no, but I'm a man all. of color. I do not tolerate that. Amen. Amen. I'm gonna say you have to look. You have to look past the color. You have to, even if I'm black, you're white. You have to look past that. Coming from the most racist demographic, black women are the most racist people on the planet. I'm still human. I bleed the same color you do. I will react the same way you do. I cry mm. the same way you. No, you don't. You don't want to <laughs> fight and beat somebody with an inch of their life. That's not the same way everybody reacts. She don't want to speak to your manager. She wants to destroy your fucking business. Right. Hey, a couple of things, though. I, uh, I, you said you're giving the benefit of the doubt. I don't. I don't think one single person said that whatsoever. Because mm. if they did, uh, the entire gliders around that person that right. said it would lynch him. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Like, where are the outraged gliders in this, like, you know, over 90% glider community? Why is the live stream? Why is every other game live stream, but this one, there's no live stream and there's no video of this? There's no, there's nothing. Yeah, like, there's, they're, they didn't do it. And I would like to see what there's the score no other story. Was. There's no up. statement from the high school. They were probably getting blown out. They're like, you know what? Let's just uh, pull the race card to this, you know, just walk about the game. Because mm. you don't think you don't, you're not buying it. It's not at all. Strange. This is just like that. This is just like that. Um, in that Utah University. Oh, uh, cool. And they're playing things, volleyball, I think they're playing volleyball. Yeah. And then, they're yeah. saying cool girls. Cool girls. Yeah. This is just like that, man. Because if, if he had said it, you're a pariah in the glider community if you even a hint at being some sort of a racist. The, the gliders love to point out racists. So we got a Dixie in New York. Mm. Like, this is just, it's a little hard to believe. Yeah. Well, I mean, this is not really New York. This is like upstate New York, like about Westchester around there. So are, um, they, are you saying that the racists are, are they yeah, like what is, what is aggressive that over there? 
are there aggressive out there the gladiators or what do you think nah like i like i mean like like new york is very like liberal like it's like california almost like once you start well, exactly getting like once you start right going exactly like outside of new york city you're gonna like find you know things a little bit more conservative especially around like westchester scarsdale so uh, spring yeah valley uh, like you so know you think conservatives are maybe a little bit racist Is that what I'm understanding from? Oh, like what? What would make you say that? Well, you said it becomes more conservative, so you could see them doing this, right? Nah, like I said, Nah. <laughs> you didn't hear what I, Nah. I, I said. I, I said I thought she's wild and like, like she's acting like people got signs and the, like I, I've been in Westchester a lot. Like I don't experience nothing like that out there. Like, like my best friend went to medical school out there. I've been out here out there a long time, you know. So. Like I'm, I'm just saying it's like you know, like New York is the really liberal place. Once you get outside of New York, it's like you know, it's not as liberal as that. But I mean, most regular, regular conservatives are not going to stand for that either. They're going to have this almost the same reaction as liberals would. They're going to be like, oh, my God, something needs to be done about this immediately. yeah, I agree. I, I, The coach I've is in noticed on it, too. that. It ain't like the coach is in on it. He's in on it, too. I don't buy any of this. Any of it. Have this Let's see. same emotions you do. Both school districts are telling us that a preliminary review of the game video and accounts by staff, spectators, and students have so far not identified any specific individual or group that engaged in inappropriate conduct. But this investigation is very much. Still ongoing. So, so far, the investigation has turned up absolutely nothing. But the news station covered it, which I think is irresponsible. For the news station to cover an incident where an investigation turned up absolutely nothing. And then to sneak that in at the end, at the very end. Oh, yeah. So far, the investigation turned up absolutely nothing. They don't, they don't they don't ask them about that like they got the chance to interview them and like is there boy, is there any reason why they wouldn't find anything on the tapes that they've taken down and the worst And this part is the... is that when that when they actually conclude the investigation and find nothing this will be You hear about if if it, yeah even if you do hear about it it'll be like for a second and then it'll never be heard update from on again. their and website. the gliders And the gliders that were accused of it or whatever school that was accused of it, they're not going to say, hey, they're going to sweep it under the rug. They're not going to say anything about it. And business And every as usual. black person you meet from here until infinity will be like, yeah, man, Scarsdale, racist. Because that's how black people talk. Black people won't say there was a racist incident at a JV girls basketball game some at one school in Scarsdale. Black people talk like this. Man, Scarsdale racist. Uh, you're wicked, like, like to my point uh, about what you were saying about, you know, if Scarsdale is racist, but like my point was that this over-exaggeration happens anywhere, whether you're in Scarsdale, whether you're in liberal New York, like no matter where you go, that was kind of like my point, you know.